That's a new nose right there. Oh, I'm just saying, are you just going to turn her all the way to the left? Or are you are you making sure that they match? Yeah, because I didn't hit <laughs> yeah. these wrinkles. Yeah. And let me do the back of your ear here. in there. There we go. New nose, new ears. <laughs> That's brilliant. One more here on the ear, okay? It's going to be his new favorite. And I'm going to be the earlove guy. <laughs> I'm gonna, exactly. I'm going to need a new pair of diamond earrings for that. <laughs> How best to show off your new ears with diamonds. Exactly. I love that. What do you think about here? Deeper. I mean, you. That's pretty good. That's insane. Yeah. Yeah, she's trying to get it. Yeah, and that's a good crust that's already yeah. forming. just shocked how simple it's much easier than getting knocked out right yes and it's easier than going to the dentist <laughs> all right i'm gonna pull these off okay are we done yeah yeah you're kidding and then no, we're not kidding oh you guys are good he does make it look easy oh. <laughs> Was it that bad? <laughs> no, I like, it wasn't. It was just, I like, you know, hand, I like, like handing no, no, them one because it gives them yeah. something to do. Yeah. I'm going to put some aquaphor on your face, okay? Thank you. And I'll, um, I'll take a, like, a big portion of it and kind of warm it up in my hands, and it's easier to glide. Mm. And you can just kind of like, like press it. Well, that's nice. Because I feel like I wind up caking in too many areas if I try to dab it. Do you want me to open my eyes? Huh? Yeah. I guess I should open you, my you eyes. You do whatever you want. You just sit there I, and be pretty while we you fix know, you. It really was like the anticipation that it was going to hurt. It, I mean, and it just didn't. No, it looks That's really great. Amazing. It's nice and even. I mean, it's it's going to look amazing. Oh, thank you so much, you guys. I'm excited to see the after results. Yeah, me too. So, um, 
On the red oh. mill that you were talking about. Yeah. So you're a big believer in retinol every day? Yeah. Is it okay? If you're going to treat it for anti-aging, the studies that show the improvement is done every day. Okay. And then what percentage do you recommend? So for anti-aging, you need point, um, two five, point zero, zero point two five. Zero point two five. Okay. Or point five. Okay. Zero point zero five. Zero Sorry. zero five. Yeah. Or you don't. The only zero. time you use one is really with the acne patients. Okay. So, post treatment, um, immediately after a CO2, we um, apply Aquaphor because we want to create that barrier. Um, we cause all these little microscopic little holes all through her skin, and now we need to shield that from um, uh, toxins and oxidants that are in the air. So she'll keep her Aquaphor on. Um, for this specific treatment, I recommend uh, two weeks. And then even at night, once your skin has sloughed off and you've got this new healthy skin underneath it, uh, you still have these new baby cells and we're in winter in Utah right now. So it's very dry outside. So I still put Aquaphor on at night, um, uh, put my moisturizer on and then cover it with Aquaphor. We've got heaters on the house and we forget about those things because that's our norm. Um, but keeping your skin hydrated is so very important. Keeping it moist is very important uh, part of your healing process. Doc, you want to add anything? No, I think that's super important. Um, keep it greasy, keep it out of the sun, and don't pick it when it's itchy. Those are the big things. And if it is itchy, what do you normally recommend if they're getting like a histamine response? So Zyrtec is what great, daily Zyrtec. And the other thing I tell people to do is put their Aquaphor or Vaseline in the fridge. Is that just cool mm. cool it off. Yeah. That's the first it's thing that gets idea. rid of the itch. Um, do you recommend vinegar soaps? Um, if they're heavily ablative um, yeah. and older skin um, or acneic skin where yeah. they're going to be purging, I do like a vinegar soak, um, yeah. but that's by patient. Yeah. How it's do you feel? Perfect. Like you just had a full CO2 done on your it face. It's so easy. On a scale it's of one to ten, on a scale of one to ten, um, as far as discomfort goes, I mean, she did have a topical numbing cream on for about an hour. What would you say, a scale of one to ten, how bad was that? Ten being the worst. Yeah. Ten being the worst. Two. Okay, so we love hearing Matt with yeah. our CEO. She's also <laughs> super tough. So. Super tough. She's super yeah. tough. <laughs> She's hiding her I would her say pain. on average, patients report around a four. About a four or five. Yeah. 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 So. But your numbing cream is important. So if you if you're new to this and you're new to compounded numbing creams, you know you can get recommendations from your pharmacist. But you want to make sure that you're using bit. something no, you're um, you're uh, that's strong enough. Uh, a lot of the over the counters just aren't going to cut it. So um, you know your pre care on that's very important as well. The air helps yeah. Oh, and just having like a zimmer for any treatment, any laser treatment, any light based treatment is lovely. Just because it 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 keeps your mind off of what's going on and just cool air on your face when you've got lasers going on is always a good thing, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 I, I recommend the non-sedating ones mm -hmm. primarily. Okay. So Zyrtec, Allegra, Claritin. Okay. Um, Benadryl just makes you really sleepy, so. Yeah. You gotta still get through your day. Right. I don't want you napping all day. Right. Yes. <laughs> Do you want me to get up? Yeah, we're good.